If your kid starts to point at something you can't see, be very careful. Here's why. A man by the name Cruz de Rosa was at home, taking care of his nephew and niece in his living room. When his niece begins to point at something, hiding in the dark. How can we keep pointing? Where's he at? Is he over there? My niece keeps pointing at someone right here in this little hallway. I'm not really sure who it is, but yeah, she's like point upwards. They must be tall or something. As he mentions he's pointing at someone, he doesn't notice, but what looks like a shadow can be seen moving in the other room. Then this door is wide open over here, man. Or just, I don't know. She's like looking over there like there's someone over there. She's freaking me out. <laughs> Look, she's pointing. See? There's someone over there. I'm freaking out. You gotta get out of here, man. You gotta leave, man. Honestly. You're not welcomed here. Leave. Wherever you are, leave. You're scaring my niece. Look, she keeps pointing at you. Get the f out of here, man. Due to the house's native history, Cruz believes his niece really is seeing something evil haunting his home. Next video was submitted by Monica Cruz, who states that something pretty creepy was caught at work. She and a couple of friends work as security guards at an undisclosed location that according to her has been abandoned for quite some time. Her job is to patrol the premises in case anyone tries to break into the property. But after being notified of a person detected on site, she saw this. No, when we check the cameras for somebody, always looking for somebody, we don't pay attention to this. To the ghost or No. Who's on call? We need to check the yeah, one in the right. office. Right. And this is the same one that's in our office after everybody leaves because I can yeah, freaking yeah, hear yeah, it. There it is. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, I'm getting chills. Yeah. I quit. Yeah. And then we hook it up. And it moves fast. Wow. It does. It said hi. It went to the camera itself. Yeah, yeah. We didn't see all that. Wait, oh my we, god. We didn't get this far. We didn't get this far because we were so impressed by the first one. <laughs> Wait. Oh, no, we didn't get this, this far? Like no. no. It's more. It's more. It keeps coming by. She keeps setting the camera up. So. Yeah. You can see the time. Yeah. Like, what the f***? This is crazy. I know it's like a lot of people. A large, shadowy mass is seen moving about in a very strange way. Monica and her co-workers mention that its movement is very fluid-like. It's because of this that they hesitated to check whatever this was. Something about it just didn't seem right. Feeling too afraid, they observed the figure through their CCTV cameras. Now despite filming an old recording, Monica states that the video still gives her chills. She says that it's the only video she has in which something truly unexplainable was caught on camera. But as always, let me know your thoughts on this one. Cats in the Cradle Nurse Marquette Jean from Mankato, Minnesota is enjoying a quiet night at home when suddenly her eye catches something strange on her daughter's baby monitor. Is 
there a cat in here? No. Oh, sorry. Love you, Nene. Are you okay? No, it's okay. I was just checking on you. Good night. I love you. I'm scary. Huh? I can't be. You're scary? Huh? Why? There's no monster in the window. I'll look. See? I'll look. On the monitor, Marquette Jean sees a bizarre figure that resembles a cat that seems to pass right through her daughter's bedroom door. But when she asks little Everly about the cat, the three-year-old instead complains that, quote, there's a monster in the window and that she's scared. Now, oddly enough, Marquette says that her beloved cat passed away last summer. She also says that, quote, Weird and bad things have been happening in their home for a very long time. But this is the first time that they have ever caught anything on camera. Marquette is not sure exactly what this is. Locked away. Over on the popular YouTube channel, Fourth Wall, they hear a story about a very haunted house. Allegedly, the entity that haunts the house is so strong that it actually took the lives of three of the four family members who lived in the home. Locals claim that only the 10-year-old son was left alive, as his parents had kept him locked in the garage to keep him safe from this evil entity. Now, that was 20 years ago. So more recently, a paranormal enthusiast decided to do his own investigation to see if the house is really as haunted as locals claim. The man places a static camera in the room where the deceased family was found 20 years earlier. What he captures on video chills him to his core. The unexplained loud shaking of the house's garage doors can be heard in the video. But that's not all, because did you see it? Someone can be seen standing at the entrance of the room, seemingly watching or waiting. After seeing this ominous looking figure in his footage, the investigator just gets out of there. The new owner of the house now fears that his home is cursed. So he contacts popular paranormal YouTube channel Fourth Wall and asks them to investigate the house. So, Fourth Wall sends in a cameraman to spend the night and capture whatever paranormal evidence he can. It did not go well. The unexplained voice of a woman can be heard, but what the voice says isn't clear. The cameraman is a bit freaked out and looks all around, but he is all alone in the house. The investigator decides to leave static night vision cameras inside and outside the garage where the little boy was found unharmed 20 years earlier. The man then leaves the property to see if anything happens while he's gone. When he reviews his footage later, he is shocked by what he captured.
The garage doors begin to shake violently as a pale figure seems to walk past the lower opening of one door. Ambling slowly towards the room where the family's bodies were found 20 years earlier. The camera outside the garage captures the same loud shaking of the garage doors, but there's no figure to be seen. So, 20 years ago, was this what took the unfortunate family's lives? And did they lock their son in the garage to keep him safe from whatever this is? You decide. You can watch this entire investigation over on the YouTube channel, Fourth Wall. We need scary videos, so if you see something that you think should be on Nukes Top 5, be sure to email us at nukestop5 at gmail.com. Oh my dude, I wish I had a better camera. Do you have a good camera? Not really. Look at this, my camera sucks. Yeah, it's fuzzy. Yeah, unless I go far away. Picture stay still and uh, push on the parts that aren't uh, dark. To adjust to the light. Dude, that shit is fucking tripping me out. That's a lot of smoke. Though. The phone doesn't even do it justice of what we're seeing. Oh, there's another one. Yeah, they're falling out of the sky. Look, that one's just sitting there. You still think that's a fucking flare? I do. Sitting there. It's not sitting there. They're, 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 they're coming down. Look at the very top. Yeah, I know. I see that. They keep coming, Dean. Look at that. You still think that's a flare, bro? I'm still going with flare on it. That's because you have no idea what it is. Well, that's the best thing. It's a trick. Look, look, look at the sky, it's glowing. That's fucking weird, huh?